The day I turned 16, I got my driver's license, and suddenly, I was free! I could be out in the open road with nothing but my own dreams to guide me. I could let the wind of adventure blow back my hair as the beckoning horizon pull me ever onward. But instead, I'm just driving my little sister to and from soccer in my mom's minivan. Kevin, you're not just driving me to soccer. I have flute lessons tomorrow, remember? This is my life. And on Friday, you're taking me to Tina's birthday party. A chauffeur to a grade school. And then Saturday, I've got ballet. I could be out there making my own destiny. But instead, I'm just spinning my wheels and going nowhere. Just like Hamster. But if I hold him up like this, he thinks he's running super fast. Look at him go. <sighs> I can't believe I'm having Hamster envy. No, 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 no. Oh, come on. Uh, why are we stopped? Can you fix it? Can you fix it? Can you fix it? No, not really. But I figured it Greetings, was... Earth ah! creatures! The two of you have been chosen. Chosen for what? Chosen to be heroes. We will now bestow upon you powers unimaginable. Oh, like the power to fly? OK, I guess some of them are imaginable, but most of them How are about beyond super strength? Yeah, you know what? We're just gonna start bestowing now before you guess them all. Whoa! I can't believe this! I know, this is awesome, right? Use your powers wisely. Okay. And use them for good. We will! Bye, Mr. Alien! You hear that? We're gonna be a brother-sister superhero team! Superheroes! This is it! This is my destiny! They said the power of flight, right? Yep. Then let's go! Up, up, and away! Hmm, maybe I'm not doing it right. It's easy, just lift your feet. Wait, where did you get the outfit? I have no idea. And, and, and where's mine? Just lift your feet. <laughs> it's not as easy as you make it. Hey, Gretel, don't do that. Sorry. It's okay, I got it. <laughs> maybe you're not using your muscles or I'm something. I'm using my muscles. It's just not... What is going on? They said the two of us were supposed to get powers. Not just you. They specifically said the two... <laughs> Get it? The two of us. They weren't even talking to you. Yep. This is my life. Who's the improbable duo that you've heard about? Faster than a scooter, stronger than metal. Who's a little girl and a domesticated rodent? Who's still standing when you see the dust? Report. This is Veronica Hill on the scene at Cliffside Park where a kitten has fallen in a well. Rescue efforts have been complicated when this three-ton boulder fell, covering the opening. The boulder came from the installation art piece, clown balancing boulder while eating ham sandwich. Once hailed as a brilliant satire on the complexities of modern life, the piece is now just another grim reminder that balancing a boulder is often fraught with peril. With me, I have Phil Pollard, who has been leading the rescue efforts. Phil, has this boulder cut off the supply of air to the actual kitten? Oh, no, there's a runoff drainage system that empties out the side of the cliff, so there should be adequate... Yes, I believe we have a live shot at that drainage pipe. Action News Drainage Cam. Is that pipe a possible avenue of rescue? Well, no, it's, it's inaccessible sticking out the side of a cliff like that. Plus, it's really small, only like a small animal or maybe a grade Wait, scorer. there seems to be some action at the pipe. Okay, I found the pipe. Great, that's the opening. It's made of cement. Yeah, that's it. Now just... It's in the side of a cliff. Exactly. That's where you want I it. I don't see any other pipes. Gretel, that's the one. Now, I need oh, you to... Oh, hamster's going in. It must be the right one. The hamster she trusts. Okay, now I'm gonna need you to make the specific turns we talked about. I'm just gonna go straight. You know I can punch through walls, right? Yes, I know, but we don't want to bust through a water main and flood the well. Yeah, but you've got me making all these twists and turns. How am I supposed to remember all that? It's not that complicated. It's just three rights... And a left. Three rights is a left. I think I should just go straight. Gretel, which way is Hamster going? Hamster's following your twisty, turny thing, but I bet I can beat him there. Whoa! Gretel, oh! no! Just... Okay, you beat me. But look, I made my own tunnel, and I only just nicked the water. Gretel! We don't know if you can breathe underwater yet! If you're just joining us, Hamster and Gretel have entered the pipe, <laughs> but the water main has burst. We've... And... 
Got to lift this. In a related story, a scrawny 16-year-old boy is using his tiny muscles, not helping in any way whatsoever. Hey, it's... Ladies and gentlemen, once again, Hamster and Gretel have saved the day. Gretel, what did you do when the water main burst? Oh, that was easy. Hamster just drank all the water. Wow, he must have been very thirsty. Ah! <laughs> Well, at least now I don't have to take a shower. And the van's almost dry. So when do we get to be real superheroes? What do you mean? I mean, when do we get to fight crime and whoop up on the bad guys? What, you want me to send you into a bank robbery? No. Come on, I bet I'm indestructible. We are not testing that out. Okay, it's dry. Now you're just showing off. Come on, I've got to get you to that mole appearance. That's delightful. Let's open it up for some questions from the audience. Go ahead, young lady. Yeah, this question is for Gretel. My best friend looks just like you, and her name is Gretel. Just like you, and she has a hamster named Hamster. Just like you. I just want to know, can you sign this t-shirt for her? Oh, sure, Bailey. Yes, she's going to love it so Wait. How do you know my name? Superpowers? That is awesome! All right, next question. Yeah, you guys hey. Hey. So Gretel still hasn't told Bailey yet? I told her she couldn't. I only told you because I knew you would never talk about it to anybody. Right, because of my disdain for people. Comic shop? Yeah, I think we got time. Kind of random that you still read superhero stories when you're actually living one. I'm not living one. Gretel is. I'm superhero adjacent. Speaking of which, she wants to fight actual crime now. So? I put that police scanner up on your phone. I know, but it's just too dangerous. Wait, I know why you still like to come here. Hiromi. Shh. Seriously, dude, you should just ask her out. I'm working up to it. And the vengeance gatherer number 36. Nice. Yeah, I like to read those. <laughs> I figured you're buying it and all. <laughs> Uh, Hiromi, is that a Duck Boy shirt? Yeah, I'm gonna watch the live broadcast of the concert tonight, along with everyone else in town. I tried to get tickets, but they were sold out. Well, you know my friend Sydney is their guitarist. No way! I bet you got tickets. I did, actually. Two of them. But as luck would have it, I can't go. I was gonna give my cousin Kevin here one of them. <gasps> would you like the other one? You guys could go together. Wait, what just happened? You have a date with Hiromi. You're welcome. Did you guys see that? Bailey was there, and I had to sign a t-shirt to myself. Wow, so meta. What's wrong with Kevin? I don't know, puberty? And then I actually got to meet her. She was super nice, and she looks even more like you in person. Thanks, Bailey, I love it. You want to stay over and watch a movie? Sure. Hey, where's Kevin? He's at a concert with a girl. Ooh. Ooh. Should I wait for her outside, or...? Mm, sure, but she's got her own ticket. All right, she can already be inside. How will I know? Well, you might have to go inside. Should I go in, then? I think I'm gonna go in. Wait, wait my, my police scanner app is going off. What's it say? Well, let's see. This is a message for the... Wait, why is my face dark? Oh, I'm just gonna... No, that's the light for the backdrop. So this here must be the... Ah, there. This! is a message for the so-called superheroes, Hamster and Gretel. Let's see if you're hero enough to save City Hall from my army of evil robots. That's right. Come on down and test your mettle against me, Professor Exclamation. I've got an exclamation point on my... on my hat. Uh... Wait. Was that an actual supervillain? This is dangerous. Do not tell Gretel because she's gonna want to fight him. Uh, too late. I already put the same app on her phone. Uh, I have to go to the bathroom. You want me to pause it? No, I've seen this one. Hamster needs to go to the bathroom too. Hamster! Welcome, Hamster and Gretel. Welcome to your doom. Guys, 
Guys, hurry, get in! Kevin, what are you doing? I'm getting you out of here. This is too dangerous. I'm sorry, are we interrupting something? Can you just give us a minute? <sighs> we can't leave now. This guy's trying to take over City Hall. And that's a job for the police. Where are the police? Oh, that's the reason I chose tonight. The mayor gave everyone the night off to watch the live broadcast of the Duck Boys concert. Frankly, I'm surprised you're not watching it. Yes, yeah, so am I. You don't believe in me. I believe in you. Can you just get in the van? You think I can't take care of myself? Gretel, I'm trying to... You're my little sister. I mean, I know you got all these powers now, but I... It's my job to look out for you. I'm your big brother. Aw, Kevin, you're a great big brother. You've been looking out for me my whole life, but things are different now. You've got superpowers. Me and Hamster, we've got this. You're right. You've got this. I'm getting out of your way. Finally. You're gonna get your butt kicked. Yes, by all means, take your time. Gretel's out there whooping up on the bad guys. I was trying so hard to be part of the team, but I guess she doesn't need me anymore. Well, all baby birds leave the nest, blah, blah, blah. You know the concert's starting soon, right? Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm heading over. Kevin! Help! Gretel! Haha, <laughs> the robots were just a distraction so I could capture you. We can't get out! Yes. This energy cage is unbreakable even by the two of you. It draws power directly from the city's power grid. So as long as this city has power, you are my prisoners. Kevin, help us! But what can I do? Think of something! You have the brains! I'm the brains? I am part of the team. That means I've got to think of something. I've That's got to... right, ladies and gentlemen. Tonight is the television event you've been waiting for. The Duck Boys live in concert. One night only until they fly... Fred, the you're friends with the Duck Boys guitarist, right? Yeah, why? I need a favor. Okay, they're going to let you make the announcement right after this song, but you won't have a lot of time. Do you know what you're going to say? Yeah, I got it all written down. All right, you're good to go. Wait! Hiromi's out there. How am I going to explain this? You won't have to. Now you're just another duck boy. Get out there! <laughs> uh... Hello! Uh, if you're watching at home, there's something we... the duck boys want you to do. Turn on your washing machine. Turn on your blender, too. Turn on your toaster and your hot plate, your electric barbecue. Turn on your stereo and all the lights and crank the AC. Use the hairdryer and your vacuum simultaneously. Forget all about conservation, no compliance. We want you to turn on every electrical appliance. Tomorrow we'll be talking about that crazy thing we did when we all got together just to overload the grid. Turn it on. Keep it going. That's what you heard the kid. Thanks, Fred. Let's hope it works. Turn it loud so everyone can hear this song. Whatever you got, just plug it in and turn it on. Forget all about your visual compliance. We want you to turn on every electric play appliance. Tomorrow we'll be talking about that crazy thing you did. But we all got together just to overload the grill. You're not getting away with this, you know. Heaven will think of something, and then you'll be in trouble. So let me get this straight. The person I should be worried about is the one with no superpowers whatsoever. That's right, because big brothers always take care of their little sisters. <laughs> is that so? Yep, even when they can take care of themselves. Ah, uh, whatever. What are you going to do? The only thing special about you is your sister and her pet. And I've got them both trapped. In a trap that feeds off the city's power grid. Yes, I heard. But you know what happens when everybody uses their appliances at the same time? A blackout. And that shuts off the power to your little trap. Bad guy punch! <laughs> Thanks, Kevin. 
You really are a great big brother. And you are a super little sister. Could we get on with my incarceration? This is not as comfortable as it looks. I'll be right with you, and you have a date to get back to. Kevin, I thought that was you. Oh, hey. They ended early because of the blackout. Yeah, I'm sorry I was late. I was just, I was taking care of my little sister. Oh, that's so nice. Walk me to my car? Yeah, sure. Hey, you missed their new single. It's about appliances. Aw, that's so sweet. You have no sense of romance. Whatever. If anyone needs me, I'll be in my wheel. Wait, you can talk? Okay, let's hose her down. We've got no water pressure, Chief. It's because of that broken water main over at the park. No water pressure? It's gonna blow! Good thing it's been evacuated because it would take a miracle to put this fire out now. Look, Chief, it's Hamster and Gretel. A miracle. Okay, the water pressure's too low, so we're gonna need to get the water from that tower up there. Use this hose. You're gonna need to find the water relief valve on the base of the tank and attach uh, it to the... Too complicated. I'm just gonna punch it. Wait, that's not Gretel! Stop, stop, stop! Relax, I got this. Water tower punch! Young man, you almost got drenched. Yeah, that was close. You should have seen yesterday. Chief, I got word from downtown. They fixed the water pressure. Looks like everything turned out just fine. Oh, great. My GPS just went out. Weird. And why do I always end up wet? You know we can go home and get you a change of clothes. No, we left the picnic an hour ago. Everyone's going to get suspicious. You worry too much. Look, Gretel, you got to take my instructions more seriously. One day there's gonna be a problem you can't fix with a punch. You've gotta learn to roll with the punches. See what I did there? Cause I fixed it with a punch. I get it. We got the napkins. Hi, mi amor, thank you. I was just about to send out a search party. Well, the first store was out, so we had to drive around a little. And why are your clothes wet? Oh, that, it, it's a- uh... Oh, let the boy be. He's a sweat beast, just like his old man. Sweat proud, son. Will do. Where's Bailey? She's waiting for you over by that tree you like. Okay! Yep, they named the tree. <laughs> I heard on Dad's radio that Hamster and Gretel were in this actual park yesterday. No way! Yes way! They saved the kitten from a well over by that silly clown statue. Can you imagine? If we'd been up here in Oki, we might have seen them. Remember the kindergarten field trip? That's when you and I became best friends on that branch right there. And look at us now! The queens of the tree! 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 tree! Oki is always gonna be here for us. Yeah, just like our friendship. What's been going on with that asteroid we've been tracking? It's gonna miss the Earth by two degrees. Eh, well, let's call it a day. Here, there's a bunch of free popcorn downtown. What? Oops, sorry, wrong number. I was looking for my nice cousin Kevin who doesn't yell at me when I call him with information about impending disasters. What's happening? We've got a situation. So why are we here again? We've got four minutes before that meteor hits the Totally Tools building downtown. Looks like they're evacuating the building, but they may not finish in time. Wait, is that Fred? Yes, now you and Hamster need to lift the shell and- Say hi from me. Uh, Gretel says hi. They need to lift the shell and- Did she say hi back? Gretel, you can have a whole conversation with her after we save the city! Right, right, we're lifting. <laughs> So what are we doing with this? We're gonna use this to change the direction of the meteor and send it back into space. Fred is doing the math right now. You're gonna want to hold it at about 47 degree tilt, about 20 feet above the building and 45 feet to the uh. Okay, Gretel, did you get that? That's way too complicated. I say we just punch it. Wait, Gretel, Gretel, we don't know the composition or the mass of the meteor. That 
We've got this. It's probably gonna be on fire. Relax, Kevin. We don't know what will happen if you Be just punch. Your punch! Yes! Okay, that mostly worked. What do you mean? Most? Well, the chunk broke off, but it's heading away from downtown towards the. He was a great old tree, and he meant a lot not only to you and Bailey, but so many other kids and families. Oki was a symbol of purity and innocence for the entire community, but maybe Oki's passing is not entirely in vain. Maybe we've learned a lesson here today. Maybe sometimes there are consequences to our actions, consequences that cannot be solved with just superhuman strength and speed and... What? Look, we fixed it with our superhuman strength and speed. And glue. And glue. We'll see you at home. Hey, Fred. Well, you're kind of pouty for someone who just saved the city. It's just that she never listens to me. But you saved the city. I guess it was pretty cool. Dude, you gotta roll with the punches. See what I did there? Because she punched I get it. Hey, Kevin, why don't you hop in? We'll give you a lift. I'll talk to you later, Fred. I gotta roll. <laughs> with the pu Yep. This is my life. Meanwhile, elsewhere... Ugh! Can you fix it, Lyle? Yes, I can fix it, Lauren! Well, hurry up. I want to ruin Bethany's life with this text, and I've got, like, no bars Greetings, here. Earth creatures! We will now bestow upon you powers unimaginable! Dude! So random, right? Use your powers wisely, and use them for evil! Wait, did he just say... Evil? That's what I heard. Yes, specifically evil. Oh, so cool. <laughs> Let's wreak some havoc. Grab!